Hey guys, what's going on? Steve, I'm back again, and I'm back with another Fear the Walking Dead tribute video. Now, the video is by Dan of Art, and the video is called Fear the Walking Dead, We Are Alive. Let's take a look. How did you end up here? Oh, that was so cool seeing the damn explode. That's a big question. There was one day... If something happens, it's better if it's me. I'm not afraid of dying. The when boat was an interesting stop. setting. All of this from happening. When you're in the air, your head on the ground. Uh, Chris? We killed him. We had to. Try this trick and spin it. Yeah. Ophelia. She saved us, but she got Was that the same type of plant used in The Walking Dead, the Cherokee Rose, or was that like People thought I was a hero. type of flower? This whole time you had me thinking that I was broken. I'm not a bad person. But I wasn't, I'm not. I was just... No one said you were. I was adapting. Somehow. I'm good now. Troy was an awesome character. Be prepared. Because when the time comes... Oh, Chris, you know I had to, right? Yeah, they as much as I like to see Troy back, like you're astray. I don't think there's any coming back from that. You don't go, we all I mean, his skull is so, like, just go. Still out there. That is a cool shot. I like how the glass just slows you down. And, you know, so what the hell is off his face. We should have talked my mom into leaving. Any place is safe, it's not. We keep searching for something that doesn't exist. We kill for it and die for it. My father, my children, my brother. We wanted to believe. I still hate seeing that. That's why my brother is dead. I never should have opened that book. First page we opened. No. That's what we start over. That's what we take everyone. At the Colonia, I believed in what we were doing. I wanted to stay. I thought it was a good place to be, but I feel it like wasn't. her character's been That's wasted ever since she died. I've, uh, like, what has she really done? Dumb things. This is my suicide now. I keep this to remind. That was a cool shot, seeing Strand with the sunglasses. I don't want to become that man again. The fire reflection. I that want to be cool a better story. person. Feature, do you see? Why don't we help my friends? That's why my friend is dead. I know where you are, Nick. Because I was there. Everything that I do is in service to this place. I didn't know how to make it stop. I didn't know if I wanted it to stop. And then Morgan came along and changed everything. We're alive. You can't let her die. We are part of the world. Jake, you pull that trigger, you're going to wake up with it every day. You will never get it out of your head. John, let me be. I need you alive. Let me be. If you're alive, this whole world. She's alive. He's alive. He's alive. This whole world feels The return alive. of Daniel once again. I can't even imagine. I'm so sorry. Where is he? He's not. No. He wasn't supposed to die. Not like this. I forgot to tell him I love him. No, no, no. Oh. Moment. There we go. Edited by Danov Art. That was cool, you know, seeing a lot of the old stuff. You know, I know a lot of things have changed. Some people say they like the new stuff. People say they hate the new stuff. I'm one of them, you know. I mean, we really don't see anything, you know, like this. I'm trying to find that, that shot with Strand in the... In, uh, there we go. Look how badass that looks. Sunglasses on, fire reflection coming off of them. That was awesome. You know, and then of course seeing the dam explode. That was that was really cool. You know, boom, taking down the entire dam and stuff like that. It's kind of a shame we just don't see that stuff anymore. And then season two with the boat. That was pretty cool. You know, we've never seen, you know, stuff with like a boat and being on a boat and you know, trying to survive in the ocean and stuff like that. You know, we haven't seen, even in the main show. Luciana, she really hasn't done anything ever since, you know, Nick died. I mean, what has she really been doing? Like, she got injured and then sat and talked on a radio. You know, she really hasn't done 
anything. Troy Koss was awesome, but yeah, unfortunately, he's not uh, coming back. You know, I know there was rumors and stuff, but after seeing, you know, that side shot of like his crack skull, I don't know how you could. I don't know how you could survive from that. I mean, I know, then again, stranger things have happened. I mean, Daniel survived. I mean, he was lucky. I mean, he had the gun right there and kind of went out like the side of his cheek and stuff. Uh, I don't know, but um, yeah, it's such a shame. Uh, such a shame, you know. Nick wanted to, uh, you know, to leave and stuff like that. But here's something interesting that I did find on Reddit. Uh, so this post says, for the first time since the end of season three, they are bringing back a pre-season four director. So for the first time since Erickson, since, yeah, the Erickson era of fear, there will be an original crew member returning to direct episode 11 of the second half. Now, Andrew Bernstein, 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 isn't just some random director. He was, he did most of the major episodes of Fear in season two and three. Uh, these episodes include season two, episode seven, Daniel's season two exit, season two, episode 15, the season two finale, season three, episode one, premiere, season three, episode eight, mid-season finale, season three, episode 15, Troy's death, Season 3, Episode 16, Damn Goes Boom. I think this is quite strange and out of place, to be completely honest, due to the fact they haven't used any other directors from the OG Fear until now. I think this is a good thing, considering this director is responsible for some of the best episodes to come out of either TWD shows. Well, to each their own, I guess you can say. Uh, this episode looks like it'll be focusing on Alicia and Strand with the trees. So that is very interesting right there. You know, that is very interesting. If that is, you know, true, I haven't really gone through all the directors and, you know, seen if someone, you know, from season two, season three has worked on the show before but if that is true uh that is you know very interesting that this one director um you know is all of a sudden coming back if they've never used any of the season one season two season three directors since that reboot you know so that's that's kind of interesting you know it does seem like he's done a lot of the uh the, awesome episodes you know i haven't really seen rewatched season one two and three so i really don't remember you know what happened in a lot of these episodes but uh yeah that's that is pretty interesting that you know he's done all these episodes and now he's doing the one i don't know if it's just going to if the if this episode is going to be only focusing on alicia and strand because then that also adds you know interest to well here's an og og director and he's working with the OG cat, whatever's left of the OG cast, Alicia and Strand. I don't know if that episode is just going to be an Alicia and Strand episode or, you know, mixed with other characters. But, you know, either way, that is, that's very interesting, you know. A lot of theories about the trees, you know, no one's gone until they're gone written on it and... If you're reading this, you're still here. Um, I don't remember what some of the other trees said, but, you know, they had a lot of Madison kind of quotes and stuff like that. So, I don't know, but that is, uh, that is very interesting. I wonder if I can jump on IMDB right now and take a quick peek. Let's see no one's gone oh that was done by Michael oh, okay so he so this director didn't do uh, Madison's final episode that was done by Michael East 
that or Azimus? I don't know how to say his name. Oh, he was a Walking Dead dude. Actually, let me bring this over. Okay, so this guy here did Madison's final, uh, final episode, but he's also an OG Walking Dead guy. You know, Cameron Electrical Department. He's been doing Walking Dead since oh 2010. Guts, Vatos, Wildfire, TS19, What Lies Ahead, Bloodletting, Cherokee Rose. So he's done quite a bit, and that was just camera stuff. Director. So he started directing in 2014. So he did The Grove, Slab Town, Try, Start to Finish. So he's done a lot there. And it looks like he's directing episode 12 and the season finale of Fear. So that's pretty interesting. Now let's jump over here to Fear. Season 5. Episode 11. Andrew Bernstein. Here we go. Yep. Fear the Walking Dead. Shiva. North. Eye of the Beholder. Children of Wrath. Things Bad Begun, Slay Ride, and then the Untitled Episode 11. And it doesn't give any type of... Uh... Alright, so it looks like other characters going to be in it. Dwight, Daniel, I'm guessing, Althea, but sometimes when you do these, they're all listed in there, so who knows. Uh, but yeah, anyways, that is uh, very interesting. We will have to... Uh, you know, see what happens. Who knows? Maybe it could be the return of Madison. They did say in season six, big changes were coming. So, guess we'll have to wait and see. So, anyways, there we go. There's some fear information and stuff like that. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. That'd be awesome. Remember, feel free to subscribe to my channel. Follow me on social media. Links are in the description box below. And, of course, leave me your thoughts and comments. Uh, what do you guys think about this OG director returning? Or, I guess, being the only director from Season 1, 2, and 3 to actually return after this quote-unquote reboot to direct an episode uh, involving Strand, Alicia, and the Trees? Let me know. And, other than that, just stick around. More videos are on the way. And I'll see you guys next time.